Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Interesting. Interesting. Welcome. You're just in time. Creatiness overladen with salt. Hard work. Let's see. Oh God. At least he didn't shout Hufflepuff right away. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Yeah. Certain expectations. I honestly can't. I'm gonna honor. I'm, I'm gonna answer these honestly, okay? If I were to go to Hogwarts, for me, you don't even have to have this epic story surrounding it. I would be happy just going to Hogwarts, living in the dorms, and just, you know, attending classes. That seems really fun. I can't wait to start classes. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Oh, I'm a Indeed. nerd, dude. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you I'm gonna for honestly challenges answer them. outside the classroom as well. Mm. I wonder. Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? Daring, curiosity, loyalty, or ambition. I like to think of myself as quite ambitious. Is it I'm gonna ambition? go with that one. I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Blindness. Mm, interesting. <laughs> You've recently learned that you possess a rare a certain amount of ability. cringe. <laughs> I detect a growing sense of ambition, an <laughs> eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Already? Oh, the sorting hat will take your choice into account when sorting you into your house. Slytherin, house known for cunning, ambition, and hunger for power. You remember years ago, right? Like literally like a decade and a half ago when those Facebook quizzes were very popular. I always got put into Slytherin, always. Thank you very much, Sugar Cult. I accept. You belong in Slytherin. Me and the boys. There it is. Hail the God Emperor. Woo! Yeah. I should dye my hair blonde now. I agree. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. You can always slither into me, Enough. logo. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't for the tempt resub. me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. This guy seems nice. I like the headmaster. Reminds me a lot of that guy with the long beard. What's his name again? Gandalf? I'm Professor Weasley, would you be so kind like as to guy. show our new student to their He comedy? looks very Dutch. Yeah, he seems pretty research. Dutch. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. I feel like I'm gonna get bullied, man. If I go to school at like, you know, I start it's in the fifth year. For a student to begin as a fifth year. I mean, I'm just it setting myself up for challenge. failure. But one I'm sure you're up for. I can be Thank quite you, uh, logic for the three years, I by the way. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. Okay, this is where enter, we slither in. Simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Aspiration. Okay. Very well. 
Aspiration. I thought we were gonna have like a, a dozen questions or so to determine our house. Not well just like done. two, but. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. Hello, Logo. I shall be back in the Your morning casting to collect you for was your amazing. first class. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first welcome night at Hogwarts. Locus. Sleep well. <laughs> yeah. IT professionals in the chat cringing right now at the password ambition. It's pretty much like Hunter 1. No special characters. Only like, what, nine letters? Honestly embarrassing. Very easy. Very easy to guess. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the comedy. Yeah, already. Wait, was it not Aspiration? Did I get it wrong already? Did I forget the password already? It was Aspiration, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, it was Ambition? Wait. No, it wasn't. Mate, I'm already locked out. I'm already screwed. Anyways, this is my place. This is my Louis Vuitton sheets right over here. I don't want to flex or anything, but uh, some of you may have a little blanket. I've got my whole bedding out of it. Seems kind of fun, man. Hanging with the boys. We have a very nice, uh, very nice bedroom, actually. Yeah, the ceiling is sick. The only problem with a ceiling like this is that you're always going to wake up with, you know, the sun. Especially in the summer in the UK. I feel like it's going to get light outside at like four. But anyways... Okay, guys, we made it to Hogwarts. Can I go into other people's common rooms? Or other people's bedrooms? No. There is no sun in the UK, Loco. Alright, I forgot. Just absolutely nothing. I don't know where the Slytherin common room is at in the, in the books. I have no clue. Revelio. Like, basically, in the UK, it goes from dark grey to light grey during the day, right? It is under the lake, is it actually? Are in order. Ooh. Oh, introductions, chat. Here we go. Everybody's worst nightmare. Walking into a group of people we're gonna be forced to hang out with for a long time, not knowing anybody. Even though they have known each other for years. Is there anything more horrifying? What are we gonna do? What's our strategy? Are we gonna try and be the funny one? Are we just gonna passively stand there and hope someone comes up to us? I could T-post to assert my dominance. There's a lot of options. Okay, this guy. This guy looks like a bit of a nerd as well. I'm gonna go to this man right over here. Look at him. He's a reading right now. Sebastian. Bonjour. Can I help you? Ah, oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Then he died. Still, impressive. Oh, sorry. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. <laughs> no, that's not his name, Chet. That is not his last name. It was pretty exciting, I'll be honest with you. It was dreadful. Tell them your diamond on the NA the server. That's not gonna impress anybody. Perspective. How did I'm you trying to make friends here, to okay? Escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What were you reading? What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but... Not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. What do you mean, mate? Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? 
Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. Ha <laughs> That is a conversation. I feel like for using the word time. kindred spirit in it high school gets you bullied no matter what good you luck do. Today. Ooh. That's fun. This place is pretty cozy, dude. What's up, lads? Professor Black glanced at me the other day in the Great Hall. I spit out my breakfast. <laughs> Not sure he sent the right message. Black noticed the scuff on his shoes the other day. I wonder how different the playthroughs are depending on what house you choose. I can imagine the main story is probably going to be the same, but... Oh yeah, we are definitely underwater. How far does the castle extend underwater? Also, how many layers of glass? Seems dangerous, but that's okay. Professor Hackett is an enigma. I think she used to work for the ministry. Wonder how she ended up here. It's gone on ominous. I, I think I heard one. As long as she doesn't hear you breathe. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Can you not look... Like, why are you looking next to me? Hold up. Is he, uh... Is he a blind character? Oh, that could be. I don't know. Like, I was trying to decide if that was the case. Or if he's one of those video game characters that they, you know, didn't code properly right away. Okay. Sometimes you have those characters in games. Memorable, more like terrifying. I'd like to make an entrance. Let's go well, with that one. If I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. Though I doubt you'll need it. Do mermaids often appear outside the common room? Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes. But I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Nice meeting you, dude. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. These slittering people are not so bad, guys, so far. I expected them to be, you know... Practicing Crucio on one another just for the memes. Talking to a girl? Ugh, oh god. Not going to move there. Oh are you? god. Oh <laughs> shit. Okay, What's here this? we go. Oh god. Um, I, I wish I had multiple you. choice options in high school talking Check to girls. It. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Um, we had it handled. We handled it. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Who? Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Good on, Dr. Feelgood. My skills on the broom, if you know what I mean. Thank you for the 34 months. Um, Not interested Goodbye, in Amelda. wizarding chess. Nice meeting you. Unless Ron is sitting on the horse and it's he can the die. It's year Slytherin in here. Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Dude, they have these things in the common room? Kind of fun. Can I look around more? Can I just... Can I go anywhere? I'm gonna go up here. I don't know how open world this game is. Ah! The face moved in the painting. We have a piano?
Dude, my character can do everything. Can you play some Drake loco? <laughs> I can play Drake. Do your thing, 21. Do your thing. <laughs> He's magical, Loco. He can't. Go on, Indigo. What a weird place to keep apples. Honestly, it's okay. The way some of those Slytherins fawn all over Professor Black, it's embarrassing. Even he seems irritated by it. Then again. Man, the world feels very lively so far. Okay, let's go. Meet Professor Weasley outside the common room. So I think she's up here somewhere. Hello. You've been standing here waiting for me. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. Good. I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Same. Can't believe Longer than you, mate. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. This guy's you like 15. I've been dreaming of that for longer than 15 Hogwarts. years. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete she have your OWLs in those glasses? at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. She's already stressing me out, man. On my yeah, first day, she's already talking about exams. It really is like high school all over again. Seriously. And remember, everything you do today is going to be important for the rest of your life. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. So what's the time period that this takes place? Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? A quest log? Yeah, I think that's what it is. Perhaps seeing it in 1890s? action will answer okay. any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. What's this? I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. I think it's loot, but I can't do anything. Or maybe I'm supposed to use my spells, huh? Revelio. Ah. I think it just shows items I can normally interact with. Eighteen ninety. Okay, it's a long time ago. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what details Revelio. the guide can provide? Uh huh. So what about this box? There's a box with an eye on it. No, I got put into Slytherin. The statue depicts the Kelpie, a shape-shifting water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long-maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported is the Loch Ness, Mo or Loch Ness Monster in Scotland. Welcome back, Hasu. Hey. Oh, I see. What's going on, Zeus? Thank you, thank you, thank you. You just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Okay, it says one out of two behind my camera. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points. Wow, okay. This is your wizarding level XP. Earned from challenges, um, or XP earned from challenges rather, increases your level and power. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenge menu to continue. Okay. So that's flying around on a griffin. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select the field guide's pages to continue. Okay. A combat quest exploration. 
rooms of or room of requirement, and then the field guide pages. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete, from appearances to critical upgrades. Gear appearance rewards, the Hogwarts Regalia Spectacles. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you've unlocked. Okay. We can uh, yeah, we can unlock Pokemon cards, basically. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. So I just hit escape and it just, okay. Yeah, yeah, it leads over here. So I've got a gear set up over here. Do we actually unlock better gear in this game? Handwear? Okay. Or is it all just cosmetic? I wouldn't be surprised if it's all cosmetic. Facewear? Gold-rimmed circular spectacles. This item has no magical properties. No, I think they will uh, They will have spectacle or magical properties then. Wand handles? Headgear. Oh my god. No. Neckwear. A natural beige scarf. No, dude, I'm good. I'm actually good without the uh, gloves as well. A prefect vest uniform. No, dude. So we can either wear the cloak or not. Flying mount? And a broom upgrade. Dude, this game's gonna be really fun, isn't it? I've no idea how long it's gonna be. Revelio. So T is for the different spells that I've got, okay. Expelliarmus, okay. Descendo. Repul or Depulso. Crucio. Imperio. Okay, sorry. <clears throat> hey, look, there's a chest from earlier. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, that is a thing. It's about 30 hours for the main story, 70 to 90 hours to do all. For 60 euro? Ah, good timing. That seems like a pretty Perfect sick price, dude. Or do I have to, to get like 17 DLCs? Flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hall. You did everything in 50 hours? Okay, so if you do it in 50 hours, Peter, I'm probably gonna take 75. Minimum. Wait, you've already finished this game. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Um, you've discovered Flu Flames, a fast travel point. You can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discovered Flu Flame. Oh, you played on early access. I see, I see. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where the students and professors live, the House of Commons and the Great Hall. Okay, that includes the left side. So what about the right side? Don't the rooms shift as well? Aren't the staircases supposed to shift? Select the Grand Staircase region to continue. In this view, you can select the flu flames available in that area. Green flu flames represent flames you've discovered, including your own house common room. Gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. The right side of the map is where you find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower, library, and greenhouses. Select the library annex region to continue. Okay. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flame for you. Use A and D to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall flu flame with... Okay. So wait, can I, can I walk there in theory? I guess I can. It's just a fast travel system, right? Otherwise, these guys will never uh, show up in time. Hey, thank you, Pewie. And here we are. Quite the time saver. 
These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. No, I had to fast travel for this particular quest. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Hufflepuff Station. That should be oh. all for now. Yeah. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Oh, I still have my glasses on. Okay, I guess it's fine. Uh, what's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain. And is home to an array of shops and pubs. Oh, is that the one they go to in like one of the one of the movies? All the supplies you require in Hogsmeade. I don't you know if I've read the books in English right now. I'm actually not entirely sure. Some of the names are in due course. some of the names are different in Dutch. Actually, all of the names are are different in Dutch. I don't really know why, but they're like drastically different. Like I I remember Portkey, but I'm not exactly sure about some of the other things. Okay. Thank you, Professor. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Castle. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Her hair is like changing color, man. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of So the of first four casting. years of this school are oh, pointless, mate. I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Man, this this game Good is not made today. for the TikTok audience, now, dude. Like I'm already starting to lose track of all the talking here. To you. And My attention span is not that short, is it? As I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Okay, I can talk to Professor Fig, or I can walk around for a little bit and then uh, talk to him eventually. I think that might be a good move. Everybody's just chilling, dude. Everybody's just, just standing around. Fair enough. Do you think we'll learn how to brew our Mortensia? It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about... I didn't mean to snitch, I panicked! Yes, sir. But I didn't tell her anything else about her travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. <laughs> yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, 
I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Wait, you've not been hammering on that for like half of an, an hour. Exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. Oh, okay. There's a map included? Okay, so the little icon right there, it represents the main quests. Completing main quests will further the story, unlock new features, and grant experience. I see. Uh, as always, I will probably focus primarily on the main quest. I know there's a lot of you that like to do literally every single thing in every single game you play. Um, I tend to not do that. But, yeah, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I I'm just gonna play. I'm just gonna play. Hey, thank you very much, Zeus, for the 46 months. That map is really nice, yeah. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In that case, you will need to be a required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as a quest reward. I see. So track a quest. So there's either the defense against the dark arts class or the charms class. Which one do we go for, Chet? Charms or defense? So this one gives me Levioso. Why is it Levioso? Isn't it supposed to be Levioso? I'm gonna have to do both. This one teaches me Accio. Maybe they're different spells. Uh, okay, fine. We'll do that one first. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. Ooh, I was wondering about You'll that. We already Mr. had a wand. He's an exceptional craftsman. Wait, and a Ollie Vander was there in 1890? I shall when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Maybe it's one of his... One of his parents, or one of his family members. So, cast the Charmed Compass. The Charmed Compass will lead you to anything you're trekking. Love that. Let's go, dude. That is kind of like the way they do it in Dead Space. I don't know why we have a minimap. I'm not actually a big fan of minimaps anymore. The more I think about minimaps, the less I like them. But th this one is, I guess, kind of small, so it might be okay. But I really like it whatever games give you as little a UI as possible. Because, like, at some point I always find myself in games like this, and maybe I'm wrong, but I always find myself staring at the bottom left corner while playing, rather than at the screen. Anyhow, you can, I think, disable it. I did, so, I did go into the settings before I went live today. There is a... Um, I can adjust my look left and right with the mouse. That doesn't seem very convenient. Um, there is a way to disable it, if I'm not mistaken, yeah. Show minimap. But it's only on or off. An auto hide would be kind of sweet, but... Anyways. Alright. We'll be doing our first classes then. The defense of the dark arch... Or arch? Ew. We have to go outside? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, we're in the UK. Never mind. I thought the sunlight was going to be a disaster. Turns out that's not a problem at all. Don't worry, guys. We're going to go make friends. This is how you make friends. I'll show you real quick. Hello? Didn't work. Hey, dude! I'm not very good at making friends. Hey! Maybe I can make friends with a cat. Hold up. Oh, dude. There it is. I don't want to flex or anything, but as I was refilling my water bottle just now, I also pet two cats. Two of them. One of them did not want to get pet. I did it anyways. He does a lot of things I don't want him to do either. 
He's like, ah, get off of me, I'm playing. I did it anyways, dude. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Okay, so this is one of the fast travel points right over here. Hmm. Laurent's getting kind of sick, by the way, guys. I don't know, man. She's losing her voice right now, it seems. So, if I end up losing my voice in a couple days' time... That would suck. Loka, stop doing this to make her yell at you. That must be it. To be fair, I just hung out with, like, you know... Thousands of nerds in a in a building over in uh, Poland for I am Katowice. It's always a little bit risky, right? Might get sick after an event. The uh, post event sickness is very real. Loco, you get to play video games though if you get sick. Ooh, that's true. Pretty hype. Okay. Didn't realize we had full-on skeletons of, like, whatever this is. I would imagine it's a rhino. Dino. Mm -mm. Oh, are, am I already missing things? I might be missing loads of things, guys. I don't know if there are uh, invisible walls in this game. I would imagine so. Hello. I don't know how to open these. I guess we'll learn that later. Yeah, it's a fictional globe. For some reason... What's what even on here? It's not even a... I don't know. I thought it was a map. That'd be weird though, because why would it be circular? Anyways, um... Gotta go. Begin our quest, aka... One of our lessons, one of our classes. This is where we learn a new spell, if I'm not mistaken. Is that all you've got? There's Sebastian again, dude. Levioso. Professor Hackett. Wow, you'd be good months. enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. Thank you, Topster. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern I wasn't Wales wondering. and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. How many students do you think die every year? To the wise, it just... age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? It's Levioso. One thing I've Not learned Levioso. as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Steady your wand with the mouse and guide it along the symbol's path to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input when prompted. Okay, I'm ready. Pew! 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 Easy. That's how you learn spells, Chet. Simple as that. So, fifth years are finally learning Levioso. What have you guys now, been up to? Let's try something a little larger. Swish and flick. Let us begin with a basic cast. So does it have a spell name? Because we keep doing this one. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. 
as Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Levioso, good. Now, well done. Easy. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso. Good boy. I know. Lucky. Nothing lucky about it. Protego. Levioso. Mate, this guy has absolutely no chance at all. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. No, chat. We can't just keep doing it. You give as good as you get. We can't just start with a Vada Kedavra's left, right, and center. <laughs> it was the defense against the dark arts. I, I mean, you, you should have known. And you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. <laughs> Thank you, Professor Hacker. <laughs> Every Glad time the we do practice. anything in school, if what someone seen dies. If is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, <laughs> and they must. Achieve Everybody it. dies, man. A classroom Didn't that pick ambition? Thing, but battling dark wizards, like that is very or ambitious ever indeed. more likely goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. <sighs> Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Slytherin has been part of many great things, Chet. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Dude, this class was like five minutes. And I have two classes like this a day. That's amazing. Hello. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. <laughs> okay, Everett. You dueled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. All right, Adelaide. I feel like Adelaide can do better, but it's okay. Oh, I can't go here. It's, wait, what? A level two lock. Ooh, not a very good mirror. Am I supposed to have drops on for this game? I don't know how to turn on drops. Always Should I look it into it? Was for first years. Not anymore. That's what I said. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Let me have a quick little look. Apparently there are Twitch drops for this game. I honestly had no idea. Um, I don't know if it's easy to set up. If it is, I'll turn it on right now, but otherwise I'll do it later. Uh, viewer rewards drops. Hogwarts Legacy, yes. Oh, you can earn in-game cosmetics? What your community needs to do is watch for 30 minutes and you can unlock a whole bunch of stuff. That's cool. Ah, uh, okay, I need to connect my Warner Bros account. I'll do that later, okay? Because I think I need to do it in-game as well. And I don't know what my password and all that is. I don't know if I can become Voldemort. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. Really? It was about how you got practice. smacked? Practice. Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Yeah, Didn't yeah, yeah, true. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Let me share. I've jeweled enough. Yeah, Consider yeah. yourself lucky I held back. No big deal. Huh. Fair enough. You owe me an honest jewel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned jeweling organization. Sounds intriguing. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most rule out one of your time of the Hogwarts, exclusive club, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Is that we Whether don't it's talk a secret dueling club about the secret or dueling sneaking club. into the restricted section of the library? You just have to be clever enough not to get Shh. caught. Thank Wait. you, Sebastian. She's right. I'll keep there. that in mind. 
Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance the today was sheer luck. literally love. right there. Oh, she's what old actual now. skill. Look for Luke and Bratton near hear. the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. I think he just gave me my first side quest. Hey, look, we have like one of those Iron Maiden. That's always nice to have in your defense against the Dark Arch class. You know, just for the memes. Accidents would definitely happen, man, because someone would go in here and then someone else would close it. I feel like a lot of this would not hold up to safety standards. What about that massive thing on the on the on the ceiling and that skull just randomly popping off? Wait, can I open this door now? Because I just got a level up, no? No, it's a level two lock. I think it works a little bit different. So I'm now level two, but I don't know what it does. I have a collections log right over here. Revelio pages. The statue depicts the Kelpie. Okay, I see. So that's what we found some time ago. Knock, knock. Who's there? You know. You know who? Exactly. Loco, do you know how Death Eaters freshen their breath? With Dementos. I suggest we ban Muktafas from this channel. Just, you know, suggestion. I mean... Make of it is what you want, but... Can we just, you know... Hey, thank you, man, for the 300 bits. Finally! <laughs> okay, so this is my quest objective over here. Complete main quests. So for this one, I can claim the rewards for legendary gloves. And then I get a legendary cape if I do four quests. Man, I feel so accomplished. Watch out, chat. My legendary gloves are coming up very soon. That wasn't the legendary gloves. These are the black standard gloves. How do I equip the legendary gloves? I don't know. So here's the legendary club. Okay. Gloves stitched with mysterious designs earned by completing main quests. Cosmetic alterations applied to gear via the change appearances option. Is this like uh, transmogrification? Is that what we're doing right now? Do we have transmogs in this game? Oh, yeah, we do. So they look slightly different, but very similar. Actually, they look quite a bit different. Oh, I didn't realize we had Trendsmoke. Okay. I have one more thing here in the field guide pages. Regalia Spectacles. Ooh, these look sick, dude. Can I have the spectacles as well? So there's only one slot for glasses. But then I change the appearance over here. Am I dumb? Don't answer that. Did I just mess that up? Um... Oh, it's because I have one of two, maybe. Maybe it's not actually unlocked yet. It says one of two anyways. Uh, I'm going to try one more time. I think I need one more. I think I just don't have it unlocked yet. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So what's in my inventory? All of this. Look at all the things. My god, I'm loaded. No, I don't think they're similar. The picture is different. Maybe it was a different color though that I unlocked just now. I'm not exactly sure. So there's a thing over here. What is what is on the minimap? Oh, it's upstairs, I think. That's probably what it is. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Loco is a great collector. Thank you, dude. 
I collect Have all the things. Oh. This is what people in Britain do all day, right? Drink tea. Pretty sure. Very fancy. <sighs> tea does not necessarily mean drinking tea, though, guys. I've been explained this recently. Uh, it's all a little bit confusing. It's all a little bit complex. So, you start the day with breakfast, right? From what I understand. However, at noon, what some people in the UK have is called dinner. Then there is also a thing called tea time, which is actually a right around like 5 p.m., which most people either call dinner or supper, but they call that tea. And then there's also supper, which would be after that, which is more of like a small snack. I thought I was being trolled, but apparently this is a very real thing. I don't quite understand. It's very complicated, man. But when people say, I'm gonna go have tea, it does not necessarily mean tea. We've had one breakfast, yes. What about second breakfast? Yo. People who boast are insecure. That's what my mother told me. People who boast are insecure? Okay. I am pretty insecure. I boast a lot. Eleven C's. Let's see. Um, quest log. I need to set up a road to my charms class. Ten points to Gryffindor. Good impression. Look at this chat over here, man. Dang. So wait, am I supposed to fast travel there? I don't think so. Uh, what was the button again for uh, guiding me there? V. There it is. That life is behind me. I promise. Alter four loco. Okay. <laughs> 